Hi guys, charity shop gold or garbage, been down to Clevedon today, all of this lot came from Western Hospice Care charity shop where everything is a pound and I think we can also do a little shout out here for Dust Devil 7 who's concerned that when I review my purchases from charity shops I quite often say that they're garbage if they don't have all the bits and pieces to go with them. So we'll review this with that in mind. First of all, uh, we'll just run through them quickly. So say everything was a pound, so I went through the um, toy box. I could see those two went together, so that was a pound. Those two went together, so that was a pound the boomerang and that controller don't go together but they gave them to me for a pound anyway so I spent three pounds the boomerang um, well I only bought it because it was in with the other stuff it's got a nice curve to it it might even work so I'll put that in the car and we'll give it a try sometime no idea what it's made out of it looks a little bit like bamboo to be honest but yeah, we might try throwing that to see what happens with it. Right, this one. I reckon that this is what I would probably call garbage because it's useless without the car. Or if we look at it the other way round, if I'd found the car and hadn't found this, then the car would be garbage because you just couldn't use it without this controller. It's infrared. I'm guessing because there's a sort of a, a flat plastic surface there. In fact, yep, infrared. And this is quite a specialised one. So we got the forwards, backwards, left, right, but we also got these like cursor buttons there. Circly to the left, squiggly to the right. Uh, no idea what that does. That says, oh, program. I reckon we've got a little programmable car here. And that looks like, I don't know, settings or something. Stop and go. Back mountain signal. I don't know if that's supposed to make sounds or something. No idea. So unless you happen, actually happen to have one of these, it's not going to be a lot of good to you. Uh, I don't know if the camera will pick that up. Trademark and copyright DC Comics. I think that says S12. Thinkway Toys. Made in China. But any time I see a controller on its own, I buy it. Because that might turn a junk car or a garbage car into gold if I've got a matching transmitter to go with it. So that's why I bought that. It's no use to me unless I find a matching car. Right, this thing looks to me, again, infrared control. Oh, it's making a noise too, isn't it? There's no obvious on-off switch on it, so I'm guessing we've probably just got to find batteries for it. And see if we can get that one to work. So that might be a separate little video on its own. Yeah, nothing much happening there. Uh, 2010 Scenario. Is the camera picking that up? Patent pending. Made in Dongguan, China. Zibits, Z I B I T S. Two AA batteries required in there. So, right, we'll make that a separate video, see if we can get that one working. And then this, it's another one of those wall climbers. I seem to have got quite a few of these now. Uh, 
Looks like this one's going to need batteries in it so we can try it out. I really don't need it, but a pound for the pair got to be worth having. Even if we only use it for the electric motor and gearbox that's in there. In fact, there's actually three electric motors because there's one drives that wheel, one drives that wheel, and another motor drives the fan. These two are geared. There will be a small LiPo battery in there. You can just about see it in there. So I'll put it on charge, see if it works. But there you go, that's today's charity shop gold or garbage. If that works, it'll be gold, but we won't know till we try it. If that works, it'll be gold, but we won't know till we try it. That is sort of gold because it might turn another car into gold and well no idea whether that's any good so we try throwing it see if it comes back well i was going to make a separate video checking to see if these worked expecting them not to but i've put batteries in this one it's already charged the car so I don't need to charge it up. So if I switch that all the way to wall. easy doing that with just one hand but that's working absolutely fine so for a pound that was gold oh, I could have charged it up but I didn't need to as soon as I switched it on it still got charge in it and this one I was just changing the batteries in the back and then I noticed if I moved the hand or the arm it's an on-off switch. I switched it on and we've actually got a bit of light flashing in there. I've got some batteries so I'll put fresh batteries in it. But he's... Oh yeah, he is working. I thought he was. He's struggling though, isn't he? I should think with fresh batteries it'd probably be all right. It may even just be that surface. I'll just try it on the floor. So it's forwards and then it turns on reverse. Oh, well, it, that's the way it was working. Yeah, that's better. Yeah. Forwards. Reverse. I think he might need new batteries. See they look a little bit corroded around the edges.
Yep, yeah, excellent. I like that. <laughs>